much for shopping with me. Yeah, it's cool. Exciting morning for jewelry it is as we celebrate 23 years traveling the world with HSN's exotic gems globetrotter. You know him lovingly as Jay King. Of course, he is joining me celebrating 23 years with us. You know, That's a big deal, Jay. You know, it's really amazing is um, if you think about it, how fast, I always say this, you know, like as you get older, time goes, seems like it increases in speed on how fast it goes. But we were thinking about this the other day. I, I I've been in business for 43 years. I, the show now, this is our 23rd anniversary, 23 years. When I first started, my daughter was 13 and my son was 11. And now um, they're oh. both uh, trying to raise, I have two granddaughters and uh, my son's <laughs> trying hard. So, it? you know, it's pretty amazy. You know, everybody is so grown up now and mm. I feel so old. And no, you are <laughs> young, still traveling to some of the most exotic locations to find you, beautiful, rare mine finds. Remember everything in Jay's line is handcrafted, meticulous attention to detail. So you're getting one of a kind pieces and treasures you will never find anywhere else. My name is Leslie. I want you to remember five of everything because it's gonna be $5 to ship all your J. King purchases. Everything is on five flex as well. So five months to pay off all your beautiful treasures. And how about this, Jay? We're gonna start the show off with a five and five. So five, 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 five and five. Everything you'll see right now, 50% off. Here we go. Okay, so some of the world's most coveted gems right here. We're talking about Baltic Amber in a beautiful uh, two-row stretch bracelet. And then the matching earrings are available as well. Jay, we're seeing honey tones, butterscotch, lemony tones, all contrasting with that beautiful world-class turquoise. And we've got matching earrings to go away. Okay, this is the material. This is butterscotch amber. Um, this is the rarest color of all ambers um, in the world. And there's not a lot of amber out there, to be honest with you. This is something that, uh, it's very exceptional, it's hard to get. Um, and what is always crazy is the crazy prices on this, okay? <laughs> and, and the, the only reason that they have these at this price is this is the, you know, the last very few that we have. You could never ever even attempt, and I'm the manufacturer, to actually make these and create these. You couldn't even buy the material. But you're looking at butterscotch amber, the last of the last of the few. We sold out on the necklaces. But this is the last few that we have. I love these linear um, earring designs, right? that beautiful bracelet. So those uh, uh, earrings, by the way, and, and the bracelet, lowest price we've ever been able to do, they do come in at about three and a quarter inches in the length. So that's available for you. We are moving on to our second of the five and five already. Half off as well. What you're looking at is a beautiful vision in pink. Now let's remember, not all rose quartz is created equally. You've got rose quartz and pink opal. Jay, this bracelet made it to be a 4.7 customer pick. Now, and I have to tell you this, okay, uh, just like what you said, Leslie, not all rose quartz is created equal. This comes out of Madagascar, this particular rose quartz. The thing with rose quartz that is so deceptive, you want to get smaller pieces of it because if you get the larger pieces, um, you, it looks pink, but then when you start cutting it, it will fade on you. Right. This is gonna stay just like this, and this is the pinkest, pinkest the rose quartz, and we right. paired it with that beautiful Australian pink opal, oh which gosh. is an exclusive for us here in the United States. Now these are all hand-faceted beads on that soft uh, jeweler's elastic wire, which is really soft and yummy, no clasp you ever have to fumble with, and we say it fits a six to a seven and a quarter inch wrist. Uh, that is item 601187. We are moving on to our third of the five and five if you love fiery bright beautiful color take a look at these beautiful drop earrings four cabochon drop uh, done with the fire uh, sorry red sea bamboo 50 percent off as well how pretty are these you know these are terrific because here's the thing they're they're um we kind of design these uh, so that they're not over the top big. I, I tend to design kind of really too big and bold sometimes, I think, you know, mm -hmm. uh, but that's just, my thing is, is um, go big or go home, you know, that's so. That's right. But this is, a, you know, so many of our viewers say, I love it, but can you do something, maybe scale it down just a little bit. <laughs> so you've got nice presents here. And again, you've got these beautiful hand fabricated sterling silver ses settings that are custom made with that really, and this is a really like a cherry red, uh, 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 red sea bamboo. Mm, and that is, the perfect scale and size on that. Those are pierced with the French wires in there. But we took it from $69.90 to, uh, $69 to $34.90. Remember, everything's on five flex, making 
it really easy to bring home your little treasures today. Now, Jay, we have the luxury of having the final 57 of one of your gallery collectible pieces, never to be repeated again, all bezel set rounds, and all the showcasing of colorful turquoise. This is seven peaks. Look at the beauty here. And by the way, it can be adjusted. And you've got all the different colors that come in. You can see the magnetic closure there. Right. And then, just like my grandfather, uh, we've got two safety clasps on it. He used to wear a belt and suspenders. He always wanted to be double sure when he was out in public, right? So, you know, like you have those people that are For also, sure his also, you know, also class. I'm, I'm the same way, uh, you know, in my plane, I've got two of everything except the actual plane, you know? So, uh, the, you know, this is something that you, you get all the different colors of Seven Peaks Turquoise. These are so wearer friendly, so user friendly. And I think it's one of the more probably the Look most comfortable link mm. uh, style bracelet you'll ever find on the market. Yeah, it feels like silk. Half off sale, you guys, and you can get it adjusted. Fits a six and three quarter to seven and a half inch wrist. 601-198 is your item number. Okay, fast way to start our show, and here we go with the final of the five and five. We're gonna talk about a turquoise that is often compared to Sleeping Beauty. Jay, this is Campitos in this beautiful drop earring, 50% off. This is Campitos Blue Ice. They closed this mine uh, wow, years ago. I, it's probably going on four years, five years, maybe even, you know, it's, it's hard to uh, actually put it in my head exactly what date they closed it. This is actually, um, I'm selling to you for what it is. It's Campitos, it's blue ice. Hardly anybody has this. The people that have this rough material, uh, a lot of it's being sold, not by them, but the people that market it or are selling it as Sleeping Beauty. Because to be honest with you, unless you really have a practice eye and you really are a manufacturer, know what you, you would think it's Sleeping Beauty. Right. But this material, uh, even in our collection, is so limited. Uh, you know, in the next probably year, you, you won't see it from us mm. at all, too. We're out. But about one and nine sixteenths of an inch. You got that sterling silver earring. Remember, these are all handcrafted. The cabochon on the post, and then that perfect little length of the drop. And that is five nine eight five three one. And that will do it for the five and five. So now we can take a breath and, and really just settle into something that is a brand new mind find from Jay for the anniversary. Only earring. You've got this reversible peach stone pendant that's coming with that 18 inch uh, necklace as well. Uh, what you're getting here are these beautiful soft colors and the fact that you can wear it in more than one way, Jay, because both sides equally as beautiful. What a stunner. We have the matching earrings available as well. Where do we start with this and where'd you get this? You know, it's, it's uh, like so many things. We're getting, you know, so many materials out of Madagascar um, right now. And uh, what's happening in Madagascar uh, is that they're now starting to develop. They're getting in. Now, as far as infrastructure, I'm not telling you that this is, they've got great infrastructure in the right. country, right? Um, you, uh, Madagascar is just, it's, they're maturing, they're growing. Um, uh, and one of the, one of the things it, that they have is they're probably one of the more mineral rich countries in the world right. is Madagascar. Mm. Um, and you've got the highlands, you've got the lowlands. Um, uh, Madagascar, for people who don't know where Madagascar is, and by the way, they don't have penguins there. <laughs> <laughs> One know, of my son's favorite movies. Ma you know, Ma Madagascar, you know, <laughs> and it's really funny that how Madagascar people relate a cartoon or an animated series to, to you know, to something that, um, that a country, but they don't have penguins. But here's what they, <laughs> if you don't know where Madagascar is, think about this. If you've ever seen a globe, you'll see Africa. On the east coast of Africa, on the very southern region, you'll see a huge island. Right. That's Madagascar. Right. Now here's what's interesting about Madagascar. Um, you know, when, um, as the uh, uh, plates, continental plates moved apart, right. Madagascar actually broke off Africa. And so, but they have, um, they have um, bird species, reptiles, plants in Madagascar that are only found on Madagascar. So it's kind of like a time capsule that goes back. Um, also, in, I'm not really, in, uh, you know, I really haven't had a geologist. Uh, they have a lot of different theories, but they have, they are so mineral rich. They have so many different things. Uh, it's amazing the sapphires, tanzanites, are not, uh, mm. sapphires and, um, uh, barrels that they're finding there. There are even um, I've, I've heard rumors. Uh, there's opals. There's appetite. Mm. Uh, they're really known for their appetite. But this is uh, peach stone. Uh, when I first saw this, I thought this was going to be a peach 
opal right. is what it looked like. Right. And when it came back, it, it does have this uh, silicas in it. It has mm. a really high silica content, which is what opals are. But um, it, it does have other uh, minerals in it, so we and can't really call it opal. And look at those shades, Jay. All of the different variations. Well, all look of those at the color, shades how, and faceted. How soft that right. is. Right. It's, 18 it's inches in the length, two and three quarter inch extender, all sterling silver. Remember, earrings are very limited, but you can get that necklace home on those five flex of $30.98. The earrings will be on flex $15.50. It's item 093451. If you love those soft, soft, really pale shades, all the shades from the lightest to the deepest, most beautiful apricots, that's for you. And with that, we are moving to a launch here at HSN from Jay. Years in the making to find this ultra rare find. In fact, in his 40 plus years of career, he said he's really only found three blue opal uh, finds. And that's what we've got here today in a graduated bead necklace. If you're seeing all these beautiful shades of soothing blue, you've tuned in at the right time. World launch, here it is, our brand new today's special. that we anticipated an early sellout. We had no idea how much people really adore and love shades of blue. We're talking about the most breathy, airy, ethereal shades of baby blue to deeper denims and chambrays to royals. I mean, it is beautiful and to think that is all god-given natural color this has not been enhanced you're seeing all of these beautiful checkerboard faceted rondelles that graduate from the most delicate and small on top all the way to the center stone that graduates to the biggest, most juicy of those rondelles. Now, this is on five flexible payments of $21.99 for something so rare, so beautiful. This color looks great on all women, all ages, all complexions. And Jay, you found it in your 43 years. The third of its kind, he said, Leslie, I, it took us so long to even get this class of material, this color saturation. Here it is, all handcrafted. What a beauty. You know, what I live for is actually mine finds right, actually going out. And when you've, when you've done this for 43 years, and I can show you, I've ramped up a lot of passports and a lot of advantage miles <laughs> in, my, in my day. Uh, I have tromped a lot of tundra. And so in 43 years, I've only experienced uh, natural blue opal, and I say natural because so much of the blue material that you see in opals is enhanced. It's color, there's something that's been done to it to turn it blue. This is a natural blue opal. This is the first time this is a, a world launch for us. Um, I don't, and I, I don't wanna say, I, I think that I've bought peridot, I think a rough out of India before, but this is one of the only that I can recall oh gosh, uh, actual rough materials actually mined in India. That's mined, not, not cut or, or you know, processed in India, but actually mined in India. Um, um, this, and I don't want everybody to think, you see this mine? Okay, that's not, a, that's not all opal. Okay, that, that actually, uh, that mine's not even active anymore. But when they were mining, um, one of the things that they found, they found this is what they call seam opal. So it took forever. They literally take a rock hammer, okay, a oh rock gosh. hammer, little pry bars, and they walk down in those pits in that mine where the, it's been exposed and they, they take and they pick this material. You can see it out of, out oh of the, uh, the sides. And this would be a seam. Now this is one of my specimens. Oh my gosh. So this Jay. is an unusually <gasps> big seam, right? Do you, see the, do you see the seam on this? And then when I say a seam, you can see the host rock in the back. Right. Look and then that. here's the seam on the top. And all I've done, I haven't done anything to this, but taken a, a leather wheel and a little bit of Zam, which is like a kind of oh abrasive, and polish that up. But it's ex extremely, extremely rare to find natural blue oh opals. Um, the only time before was in Peru. Uh, it's called Andean Blue. You can't get it. I mean, it's, it's more expensive than gold if you find it as a private collection. Anytime I find somebody's stash, we literally sell out in seconds. Oh, my gosh. Or uh, there was material from um, Idaho, actually Oregon on the, on the it's Idaho-Oregon mm. border. Um, yeah, potato, potato, it's right there. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> um, we, uh, and that we brought on, and we did that about 
at least it's been over 10 years. I want to say something like 15 years ago. That material we sold out in a flash. Oh my gosh. And uh, I can't tell you how many people have been asking me for that same material. So this is the third blue opal. Oh my gosh. In my beautiful. lifetime, okay, in my professional career that I've ever been able to capture the rough, get the rough. But here again, this didn't happen overnight. Look at this that. took years of collecting. And look at all the different colors. Oh you have from gosh. that deep royal blue yes. to a medium, to a light, to a sky blue. So you get all, the whole spectrum of blues oh my gosh. all in one um, uh, Fabulous I, necklace I have design. to tell you, the picture doesn't even do it justice. If you think it's beautiful on your TV, if you think it's beautiful on hsn.com, when I put this on my neck, I was floored. There is something about all of those variations of the blue, from the most pale, breathy blue, to the softer chambrays, to the grayish blues, like a stormy sky, to the deep denims. That is all natural color. I mean, it really is a wonder. Now, remember, this is 18 inches in the length. You do have a two and a half inch extender all hand faceted beads so they catch the light beautifully but look at all the ways you can wear too and I think that's why so many ladies are responding today from casual looks to an evening look to a little much more office attire to your Sunday best I mean this is really very wearable and Jay everybody knows that the color blue when they've done studies is the peacekeeper, the soothing color. It just puts us all at ease. It looks beautiful on all complexions. It's meant to symbolize loyalty and royalty. I mean, it is absolutely a winner. And to think, Jay brought us this very special gift today as a world launch for the 23rd anniversary. It really is such a rare treat. We do expect an early sellout on this because people love blue. We love how it makes us feel. We love how easy it is to incorporate into all our outfits and to think this is a handcrafted treasure. Every single bead, checkerboard faceted by hand. I mean, this is a labor of love and so ultimately rare, as Jay's saying, in his 43 years or 40 plus years of career, to think only three that are worthy of bringing like this. Well, right? Only three that I've ever found. If I found more, I would have brought them. This but is what he does all day <laughs> in, I mean, his travel and search, okay, right? But this is very rare. It's very so unique. Um, it's not an unlimited resource. Um, like I said, um, uh, the process on this, and, and, and you know, they, well, first of all, they gather, they mine it. This is all done by hand, literally archaic, okay? They do it with <laughs> like a specimen hammer. They go around, they have these little pry bars. Uh, we, we actually, uh, we have footage of them. Uh, of course, uh, you can see right here. Here's what we do, okay? This is how it comes to us, right? What's the uh, first thing we do? We sort it by color, we sort it by size. That's the first thing. And the reason we do that color and clarity is because uh, the, uh, the clearer material, the, and when you grade all the material, it's gonna be set aside for the cabochons. The bead material, you can actually uh, incorporate, uh, uh, like you see, like we've done, mm. where I can put a few more colors in it, right? And right. you still have that fabulous look. So that's the first thing you do, mine it. That's the first thing, we're getting it directly from the miner. Right. It's brought in, color sorted, and graded. Mm, how many years in the making? Because I mean, if they are still mining with very rudimentary tools, if they are doing it the old fashioned way and then they have to, you know, pick and sort and then we have to facet. And I mean, this is years, right? In the making, well, you know, like um, uh, how any project started and this is, we're demonstrating here how they process the material. Mm -hmm. They're cutting, that right there, they're hand fasting. That's they're doing cabochons. Uh, there, they're making beads. That's how all these beads are cut and fasted. They're mm -hmm. all individually hand done, all individually hand strung. I mean, it really, it's, it's Mother Nature's artwork to create it in the first place. Yeah, I, without All what we do is we take what Mother Nature has given us and then we create from there. We kind of just polish it up a bit, mm. but this is all natural. And here's what I want everybody to understand, okay? Um, I travel the world and the two things that start all my trips, 100% of all my trips, I'm leaving to either go to a turquoise mine or a turquoise deposit or a deposit that I've, uh, to go to do, do another deal. Or I'm leaving to a, a brand new opal deposit or, or to buy <laughs> opal. That's how all my trip starts. Now, after that though, when I go on the trip, everything else spiders from there. And that's so <laughs> crazy. But these are the two core basic materials in my life that, that really kind of uh, I'm centered around. 
turquoise, number one, and opal, number two. Yeah. So I have seen opals all over the world, all over the planet. They all have a story to tell. Mm. The blue opals, the natural blue opals, are some of the more rare opals of, of, mm. of this particular family. There's actually uh, seven different categories of opal, mm. styling from fire, jelly, uh, crystal. Um, so uh, this is unique also in another factor, not just the natural coloration of My the material, gosh. but the fact that very few opals are hard enough that you can actually fat, facet them. Right. They have to have a certain density, oh, they dead. have to have a certain hardness, otherwise they won't take a facet. Mm. And by doing that facet, you're giving that, that, uh, that natural blue color, you're giving it that little extra bling, that little extra shine, that, that little extra sparkle. My goodness, and you know, to get these colors normally, you'd have to get something that's dyed, or you'd have to, you know, purposely go out and search for something like this. This is what, I mean, if you don't believe in God, if you don't believe in Mother Nature, mm -hmm. I mean, this, you cannot, do this. You cannot hand create this. The colors you're seeing here, I mean, that is perfection. And this is natural God-given color. This is not enhanced. This is not dyed. All that is done to that is that stabilization, is that faceting, and all done by hand. Now, I want you to see too, because you're getting the faceting even on the smallest of those rondelles, because every single one of them is sparkling and catching the light so beautifully. And then it graduates in design to the bigger beads, the juice your beads and you know no two will ever be alike and so well, and that, you know that, that is it, it's so Which cool that you said you? that because here's the key thing right there we have four or five uh samples right here on the set right now Look with how us, different okay they are. every single one of them it's all the same material but everyone is going to be uniquely different in their own right. That's because of their natural colors, right? These, this is what Mother Nature uh, gave us. Mother Nature doesn't make everything the same. There is no same, same. There are a few items that are close, and there's, you know, where you can get almost like, you know, the colors are almost too perfect, where they almost look like they're fake. But uh, in in most cases, Mother Nature, she she does, and, and that's the cool thing with that's Mother amazing. Nature. She makes things, everything's a little bit shaded different and everything. Well, these are hand cut, hand done. My so gosh, yeah. every one of them is gonna have their own little character twist to it. Mm. They have their own little color combination. Now you can see, we have other, we're gonna show you later the oh, yeah. upsell items that we did for this. We like, we have that beautiful cross pin and a few of those left. The coming up next, by Bracelets, the way. Bracelets, a few of those are coming up. Yep. And you're gonna see on the, the more, the continuity of the color ranges on on those on those Look and that's different. where we have gone through taking hours literally hours hours thousands of hours not hundreds mm. thousands of hours hand sorted everything by grade and color mm. these are now, absolutely these, where breathtaking. They, they look okay it's all they've got each ne necklace has all the color range mm -hmm. that you find in yeah. this beautiful yeah. natural you're, rough material you're not going to get one that's pale and right, washed right. out like they all have they the they all are going to have the color. different colors but there is no way that you could say well the, these two beads are going to be dark royal right. blue these two <laughs> <laughs> are going to be medium. It's like, but you have four different individual colors here, four, four different in individual colors from like a sky blue to a dark royal blue in this wonderful um, new necklace design. This is so breathtaking. And I will look at Jay in the eye and be honest with him. When I saw it in the picture, I loved it. I thought it was beautiful. I love the story of how rare this blue opal is. Remember, natural color here. But when I put it on, it took my breath away. I, I walked towards you. You know it's true. I walked towards him and I said, Jay, holy cow, the picture doesn't even do it justice. And so you guys, I mean, look, I, and I'm not, I'm not bragging. I'm very hard on myself most of the time. I mean, doesn't this look great on, com on any complexion from Laura to what I'm wearing and how easy it is? I'm wearing green. Would you ever put green and blue together? But there's something so natural and beautiful and soft about these blues that they almost become a neutral and just bring light and life to whatever you wear. I hope you try this out. It is so very special. It is so very rare. It is a world launch. And let me tell you, Jay wouldn't just bring us any old necklace for his 23rd year here. I mean, you really pulled out all the stops. And this here again, this was developed uh, over years to, uh, from the mm -hmm. time that we first saw the My material goodness. to being able to acquire the material, to be able to actually gather enough to even do this. Each one of these necklaces um, takes anywhere from three to four pounds of the original rough material wow. to just to make cut 
one necklace. And I tell people that and they go, what? You know, so no, it does not weigh three or four pounds. Right. But you have to, the natural rough, which you saw right there, um, that was uh, in that photo right there. You see the natural mm -hmm. rough that we're using. We're cutting it from the natural rough. You will have to use each one of these necklaces. Start off with three to four pounds of those, Beautiful. of the, the bigger, um, the, the seams, the pieces that have been color graded and sized. That's what we start with just to make one necklace. So just think about that. Oh just the cost of buying the rough material before you start doing any of the labor if you start doing any anything with this, just the cost of the natural rough, the quantity that it's required to be able to cut just right. one individual necklace. Right, and, and you guys, it's one day only. We have it modestly appraised. Now remember, HSN, we take all our pieces to three independent appraisers. The lowest price we've got back was $225. And there's really no way to even quantify that because this is so rare, this material. So remember, that one fine that was great enough to bring for the 23rd anniversary that's going to look good on all women, all ages with these gorgeous, they look hand-painted, Jay, but that is its God-given color for $21.99 on five flexible payments. Remember, bring this home, put it on, it will do what it did to me. I, it took my breath away. The picture does not do it justice. Remember, we do have matching pieces. We're gonna get to them in just a moment. But if you want our best value of the day from Jay, it's 629-866. What a beauty today. And if you're an October baby, you know the opals are your birthstone. I mean, you, you tuned know, in right on. You know, it's really funny too. We had a lot of callers um, this morning, um, and, which is really cool. There are people that collect opal. They collect mm. the different, and that's, I think, a lot of the mind fine viewers do that. Other, they collect the different corals. They collect the different turquoises. Mm. They collect the different. Uh, we had a wonderful caller last night that she named off, um, and she named off a lot of the opals that you like peppermint right. opal. All the different opals that you can't even get anymore. Right. I mean, you know. So, um, and that's the thing too. So, I mean, it, th these are not, not find this. Yeah, th this is right. a renewable resource. Okay, when you find <laughs> these, it's not going to. They're going to last forever. Okay, no. they're not renewable, and they do go away. I literally, I'm I'm doing cataloging right now on specimens. At, at my uh, my office warehouse, whatever you want to call it, that my personal kind of man cave, and I, I literally have thousands, thousands imagine. of specimens need to do a of materials that I've, I've done over 40, 43 years that are no longer available. Uh, your item number on our best value <coughs> of the day. Look, you've got nothing to lose at twenty one dollars and change on a credit card. It's six two nine eight six six. Now, as promised, here are the matching pieces. We've got that three stone cuff that is extraordinary and beautiful. If, you, if you're more of a bracelet girl, we're saying this will fit a six to a seven inch wrist. Jay always says, no, Les, my bracelets are so well made. You can get away with it if you've got a larger wrist, but uh, six to seven inches. Remember, because everything's on five flex, you can get that bracelet home today for that, uh, let me see, $53 a night. That's less than $2 a day to get this three stone dream blue opal home. How beautiful. Jay, there's a special way you make your bracelets, your cuffs in particular, that people really appreciate. And and all of our jewelry why. Um, primarily is made the same way that we're old school. Right. Um, we're, we're different in the fact that our jewelry, we have silversmiths. Okay, <laughs> this is what all. A concept, this, huh? this is like, <laughs> this is custom um, uh, made uh, uh, sterling silver sheet material. And just like, I always, I kind of grin when they six, say six or seven inches. I guarantee you, I don't I not have a petite wrist, okay? I don't have a six or seven inch wrist. <laughs> and I could yeah. easily wear this, no problem, and with no problem. And I also, the people that are even larger than me could easily do this. Right. And the key factor is how they're manufactured. This is this is an um, almost getting to be a lost art form. Mm. Uh, we have custom made sterling silver sheet materials in different thicknesses, different things. We give it to our silversmiths, uh, and then we have uh, we work from the natural. We do everything in house. Oh we work from beautiful. the natural stones, and so we have lapidaries that and they they pair together. Um, so these are really truly labors of love. Uh, this is an art. It's wearable art. If you if you like that big bold look, and here again, on on the cabochons for uh, anything you see the, on the, the accessory items for the bracelets, the earrings, the ring, uh, any of this, you can look at the different grades of material. Mm -hmm. We only select these highest grades 
of the material available. Right. So that's when I said, the first thing we do is we select by size and then we select by color and then we do color grading. Do you realize the thousands of hours, the thousands of man hours that go into, uh, in this case, when you have a project this large, to be able just to do that part of the process. Mm -hmm. It takes forever, it's so time consuming. Um, but you can see it really comes out. The, the lapidaris, they sit there and they hand select mm. each of the pieces that they're gonna cut Look by that. size and by color and grade, color grade, so that they can um, uh, cut the, the cabochons. In this case, they actually cut the cabochons, they put them on, um, it's kind of like a little sticky board thing. They take it, um, they, they arrange these, so they do all the cutting and all the fasting. Oh they take it to the silversmith. The silversmith literally builds that cuff or that pendant, or those earrings, or that ring, oh literally builds all the silver around it. So the silver isn't pre-cast, pre-set, uh, uh, formed, molded, or anything like that. Oh Every one of these, they actually do it in reverse. So in most <laughs> cases, um, what people either stamp or they'll cast something, and then they'll cut the stone to fit that particular mold. Mm -hmm. In this case, the lapidaris cuts the material first, cuts the cabochon, right. whatever size or shape or what it's gonna be, and then it's given to the silversmith, and then the silversmith actually builds from scratch builds around those oh cabochons. Oh my gosh, I mean, a labor of love. And that's a lost, a dying art form, essentially, is what it, it, it is. It truly is becoming a lost art form. You know, you just, it truly and that's is. why these pieces are so special. That's why some of you have been shopping with Jay for 23 years and still have those, and they look brand new. And so, if you want it, the ring comes in sizes five through 12, also that large, beautiful opal. Uh, because it is a larger band, I might recommend humbly that you size up on that one, but it is a split shank, so very comfortable to wear there. Beautiful facet oval there that's a three stone cuff as we said uh, it, what a treat but because everything in Jay's anniversary is on five flex you are bringing home these treasures and I can't wait for you to get them home 093303 is your item number let me remind you lots of special things happening for Jay's 23 years with us at HSN remember the number five okay very easy five dollars to ship all of your J King orders. Whether you're ordering two pieces or 20 pieces, you're only gonna pay one shipping fee. And remember, flat flex pay. Five months to pay off everything. And flex pays for everyone that shops with us. You have a debit card, a credit card, you can break your purchase down into five monthly payments uh, to go ahead and enjoy that. Okay, so we're gonna move on. A two minute special on these gorgeous pieces. We've got the silver cross pendant done in that dream blue opal that Laura's been wearing on her today's special. We also have a really beautiful drop earring as well. The earrings are $97.50. Uh, the pendant, $109.90. Everything's on five flex, which means you can get that cross pendant home for $21 and change. And the earrings, $19 and change, Jay. I mean, once again, if you can't afford the today's special, if you're more of an earrings girl, I mean, this is your way to get in on this ultra rare find. You know, and here again, you know, not to sound like a broken record, I just want to emphasize the, the art, uh, mm. it, you know, a lot of times I, uh, and a lot, I get a lot of grief from it because <laughs> we're in niche mm, business. Yeah. We're, I mean, we really go, we write, go, we go mind direct. We work uh, from scratch on everything. So we're, we go mind direct. The, the first we get away is a consolidator. Uh, we do all the designing in house. We don't have outside God. designers. We do all the silver work in house. We do all the lapidary work in house. So everything is done in house. Okay. Uh, so maybe not under one roof, but it's all done by by us. Right. Um, so we do this because we want to control the quality and also um, uh, we can control what we're doing completely. This isn't, we don't have a catalog. We don't, um, we don't make massive quantities and then hope to go out and sell them to somebody. Um, we design, um, uh, I work very closely with my buyer here. Um, the only place oh that gosh, you can actually crazy. see these mm -hmm. is you can, uh, the only place that you'll actually see the designs right here is the mine finds. And we don't go to any other markets. Jay, this is the are, only market. They're interrupting me because it is last call officially with the final 90 of the cross pendant. Uh, remember that cross pendant is a little under three inches in the length there. Uh, final 80 in the drop earrings, Jared, is that correct? 
So what you're getting are these multi shapes. You've got that uh, four stone drop where the top is that barrel shape. And then you've got the three graduating barrel shapes, all faceted there, all sterling silver, you guys. Uh, remember, handcrafted, so they really are unique treasures. And then that cross pendant, just the bail alone allows you to go ahead and play and put that on a leather cord or a ribbon or on your other it, bead. It, it, on it's got a large, says, enough, right? a large enough bail on it. And this is really what, what's sure. great. You could pair this back. If you, uh, anything that you've got, if you, you know, like black, pearls, um, uh, even turquoise with the blue will go fantastic. Lapis would look amazing. If you've got a lapis necklace, it would look amazing. Collars, and th that, and here again, uh, the reason we do that is that they're, th because of how they're created, they're, they're uh, created from scratch yeah. by hand by our artists. So um, you, oh each gosh. piece um, is a truly, a piece of wearable art. Mm, uh, it's it's a workable, wearable art. Look at the reverse of those earrings alone. I mean, my goodness, the quality well, of that bezel. I, I love this, lin uh, you know, when I design these, I've been doing a lot of these oh. lately, but you, these linear designs, I love them. And people with that wear uh, their hair longer, oh. and they have long hairstyles, See? go gaga for yeah, it. Yeah, and because they stand the biggest out. Thing, <laughs> the biggest thing is you can have beautiful earrings on and you cut your hair down. And, and, and they glow. Yeah, and you can't really see them. But these, I guarantee you, the way that they move and everything and the linear look of them. So, Anybody who has the wears their hair short, yeah, I mean, you're always going to notice the earrings. And Jay, but when final, you have longer hair, Jerry, it's harder. did you say what? Final 80? Final 50 in each of these. So if this is what you They're, want, you yeah, got to jump in. 0933 yeah. uh, 287. Sorry, Jay. Yeah, the, these, um, and just so you know, the, the accessory items, um, you know, again, there's not thousands of them made. Okay, so when they're gone, they're gone. And this is anything yeah. that we can repeat on. Now, remember, 2,700 of this beautiful dream blue opal, an ultra rare find and launch for us here at HSN today to honor Jay's 23 years with us. Traveling the world to all these loca locales, uh, this one in particular from India and what you're getting, that is God-given natural blue color. Look at all of those beautiful shades in those beautiful rondelles, all hand carved, hand faceted. They go from the tiniest of the rondelles and it graduates in size, but look at that. They look like they're hand painted, Jay, and in Jay's 40 plus years of career, I mean, he's never been able to do, I, three times he's found blue opal. So we're talking about ultra rare. This is what Mind Find is all about, right? Well, the, yeah, if you think about this, and literally, I'm talking 43 years of traveling literally around the, the planet Earth, okay? Um, <laughs> it, you know, it's amazing. I, I go out to this day, and um, I'm amazed that I find something new. Mm -hmm, right. But in this case, it, um, you know, like I say, I, one of the things I specialize in oh is turquoise. Gosh. The second is opal. And I was so elated when I originally saw this and very, saw the very first specimen that came out mm. um, to be able to obtain this. Like I said, in my career, in 43 years, I've only seen blue opal, natural blue opals yeah. that haven't been enhanced Look at that. three times. This and is so, a new natural rough. And so we'll leave this available for you, but we are expecting an early sellout on this piece. It is that rare to get natural blue color opal, $21.99. You have nothing to lose, but this gorgeous necklace that's going to light up your face and your complexion. It is a world launch. 629-866 is your item number. Remember, everything on five flex, which means... Even masterpiece items like this that maybe you never dreamed you can get. Jay, this comes from the same mine as Sleeping Beauty? Yeah, so Sleeping Whoa. Beauty, is, Sleeping Beauty, which is no longer available, was mined oh in a copper God. mine um, in Globe, Arizona. This is Wild Horse, this material, came out of that same copper mine. Oh, Jay. And uh, the individual who makes this, the artist that makes these bowls oh for us, uh, it's, they're all individually uh, handcrafted in Scottsdale, Arizona. And this is from his private stash, right? So he, what he's <laughs> doing now, um, we're, he's a little bit older than me, uh, not much, right? I'm just, I'm just right under him. But uh, he, uh, you know, he's, he's well known in the industry. Oh my gosh, uh, one of probably one of the, the better known people. I never mention his name because I don't want everybody rushing to him. Um, so uh, but he lives friend, in Scottsdale, yeah. Arizona. And um, this is from so his private collection, his private, the materials. He, he's, we started out with the turquoise bowl. Right. The amber bowl was such a success. No, the people collect so, these and they go. Uh, yeah, and he's, but he's going through, these are materials. Like these bowls, do you realize that it, 
It took them over a year to make the bowls that we have. We sold, uh, we released them this morning. Isn't it like this more is than one, one of the day very first time that we've actually been able to even release them. We held right. them back so that you could actually have them on the show to show you. This is brand new. When these are gone, they're gone. And the reason they're gone, there is no more material available. No, no. This is this is a very limited material that was collected probably over 10 years ago, mm. maybe maybe as much as 20 years ago, is uh, it, uh, from his private collection of materials that, oh he, that he's kept over the years. And look at those colors. Uh, the fact that I can get this home on the five flex. Remember, five credit card payments for everybody shopping with us right now. $130 to get it home. We'll ship it out to you. It is a work of art. It is an heirloom piece. You it's truly it a work of art. And wait till you see the response, not only your response, but when people come into your home, uh, when the people come to my home, my office, any Look place, I, and I have a few places that I that I stay and live, people are drawn to these. It's mm. it's crazy. It's it, they, they're it's like the magnets. Yeah. And this is so well made. And again, they're here again. These are all individual, one of a kind pieces. There's no two of them that will be totally mm. identical. Mm. Six three two nine zero six is your item number if you want this. Please think about it and don't take too much time to order because they always go. Certainly a collector's piece, Jay. Uh, here's a little update. The okay. earrings and the cross now sold out. And so thank you for your calls. Hey, remember, call in. Become part of this show. Say happy anniversary to Jay. We're going to take a quick little moment. We're coming back with more Rare Mind Finds. Here's your merry update for today. Andrew Lessman is here tomorrow, but starting today, you can get free shipping and anniversary pricing on all Andrew Lessman vitamins and supplements. Bundle up the season with Marla Wynn Fashions. Tune in tomorrow to get four flex pay on all Marla Wynn coats and sweaters. And don't miss Michael Simon today with his great kitchen gifts from Simon Home. It's time to get gifty. Find your merry on HSN and hsn.com. Worry about one less thing with our Protection Plus plans at HSN. Computers, printers, cameras, fitness equipment, even jewelry can be covered with a plan that offers repair or replacement should something go wrong. And portable electronics feature accidental damage from handling, which covers unintentional mishaps like everyday drops, spills, and cracked screens. Shop smart and protect your purchase. It's easy to add when you're checking out. Search Protection Plus at hsn.com for more details. It's a two-day celebration with your favorite host and our favorite gifts. And picked by us to help you find your Mary and be the best gift giver ever. It doesn't get any merrier than this. Holiday Host Pick, October 19th and 20th on HSN. People know they can be guaranteed that when they tune in, they're gonna see something new and different. I had this urge to travel from the time I was little. I enjoyed so much just the different cultures and the way people are and how they, they live. Being able to combine all the stuff I love, like flying, traveling, observing other cultures, finding cool materials, and then being able to make that all come together is really, really wonderful. I think it's safe to say we all live vicariously through Jay King's travels and we wait for you and we tune into your shows because we know that Jay brings us things you just don't find out there like this. We're talking about one of the big three when it comes to colored gemstones. You always think of rubies, you always think of emeralds, you always think of sapphires. How about a strand of indigo blue sapphires on this 18 and a quarter inch necklace? Look at this appraisal, $350. That was the lowest price we got back on this strand. Today it's yours for $199.90 and you can bring it home for less than $2 a day. That's a $39 flex pay for a strand 
of gorgeous faceted sapphires. Jay, my son's birthday is in September. I want this so badly. I think I'm going to do it if there's any available. Really? I, I just heard, you know, my, oh. my birthday was in September Bridget, also. Happy so, birthday, Jay. Um, uh, I want to say this, okay, oh uh, you know, sapphires, right? They, they really popped up on the market now. Uh, they're extremely, extremely popular. They're fairly rare. Um, I mean, you, you don't really see them in every, even every continent. Um, but what, uh, before I was talking about Madagascar, and this is the, and I was telling you about what's happening with sapphires, mm. they are finding some amazing, amazing materials. And this is one of those, and this is Indio blue. This is, mm. the, and here again, um, most sapphires oh my gosh, Jay. that are this color, the largest percentage of them that you see that actually have this color clarity have been enhanced in some way or they've been treated, mm. right? They've done heat treated. I'm not saying it's a bad thing. A lot of times it increases the value, it increases the looks yeah, of Yeah, they help it but along. these are the natural colors. <laughs> it's very rare to get this quality. Now, that being said is... Um, and you look at this price, one of the biggest <laughs> things that's so funny is when we, when we have these appraisals on our materials... And when they go out and they appraise the material, um, it's really hard for them to, uh, to actually determine a price because they've never really seen anything so large. Right there, you're getting a lot of kind of washouts. It's more of this but color right this. here. Look That's why this. I hate those close up yeah. shots sometimes. Look at this. That, you got to see it, it live. Because when yeah. you get that real high uh, bright light like that, you really kind of wash the color. It changes the color on you. This is uh, why oh they call gosh, it Indio yeah. Blue, though. You have these really, really deep, deep Indi like, like India ink, right? It's that India ink blue um, and that's the color of this sapphire I know Th these are <laughs> really just um, I I'm just telling you that that sapphires um, come in every different color of the rainbow but this is one of the more highly sought after colors that this material comes in and, I did and we get it from Mozambique yeah. Tanzania yeah. Um, I used to get a lot of it uh, from South America yeah and but now uh, some of the the um, really super high quality materials we're getting out of Madagascar so I'm really excited I about did it. read an article on the GIA website about the some of the finest sapphires right now coming from Madagascar some of, I they're, mean, so rich they're finding colors in Madagascar and colors and clarity mm. that will blow your mind yeah. of, of things the, I heard a rumor the other day and I'll you know, I'll be able to confirm this probably in February that they actually are starting to find diamond now. But oh, I'm, uh, but I don't wow, know. I haven't okay. seen it. I haven't seen that. But uh, we get a lot of appetite. There are so many. They are such a mineral rich country, and and they're just they're just literally scrape, scraping the top of the mm -hmm. surface now. Now that they're starting to get infrastructure in, they're getting a little bit more sophisticated where they can get to it. Um, now, and I will, that being said, none of these mining operations, these aren't huge operations, okay? This isn't something where they mine it year round. They go in and they, they're not really sophisticated. Most of this is mm. very simple. Uh, hand mining. Oh there, it's, um, you know, like a big piece of equipment might be if they have like a, a backhoe yeah, or something like that. Sure. But in most cases, uh, it's all literally pretty much done by That's hand. That's fascinating. We have one minute on this, you guys, and this is a treasure to own. If you are a gemstone collector, I mean, where do you find a strand of sapphires in the color that when we close our eyes, we think sapphire should be? You know, sapphires come in many, many, many different colors. To get that color without dying, without enhancing, to get that God-given blue that is rich and velvety. I mean, this thing and the faceting on top of it makes it twinkle like a night sky. Remember, it is 18 inches in this strand. It is a graduated strand, but look at even the smaller beads, how they've been hand-faceted to get the maximum sparkle and dance with the light, right? So you get all of that beautiful light. I mean, it is is extraordinary. That and is a strand of genuine sapphire. Bring it home for $39.98 And the today. key word is hand hand fasted. <laughs> this isn't done in a machine. They do have, believe it or not, they do have fasting machines. These are literally done by hand. They take the rough mm. material. Each bead, each individual bead, uh, they facet one side I'm of the bead. Then they break off the daubing stick. They yeah. put wax. They put the daubing stick on the other side. And then, so they, they facet the bead twice. So they facet one side, 
and then they go back and they reconnect it on the dobby oh. stick and they facet the, the other job. side. Didn't do a good job. I have to put it on because when you think, I mean, some of the most beautiful, luxurious gemstones, colored gemstones, you think rubies, you think emeralds and sapphires. Those are the top of the list consistently. Where do you get a strand of sapphires? You get it from J. King. It's 62863A and we are very limited on this. If you want it, my goodness, you have to jump in. Now, Jay, this was one that was not scheduled to air but we had to show it because Jay said to me, Leslie, I can't even <laughs> buy the turquoise to make this necklace. It is 50% off for this nugget necklace. Uh, you, Jay. You know, here's the thing, I'm just gonna let everybody know. Okay, so this is my 23rd <laughs> anniversary. Leslie and I were going over the show before you get, and, um, and I, I will tell you right now, I mean, they do the craziest stuff sometimes, and this is just crazy. And now, you're not gonna, because we're gonna focus on opals, there's a lot of things we're focusing right. on for this event, because my 23rd anniversary, we wanna do something special. And you know that we're all about turquoise, we love turquoise, but you're not gonna see a lot of turquoise on this. So they had this, we weren't even gonna show this, and she showed me this price, and I said, do you realize, do you I realize said, these are- are you okay these are, these this? Are, this is Azure Peaks, okay? This material, it's not readily available. Look at the-, the oh. Oh. The size of these nuggets, and these are all natural nuggets. Look this isn't that. any kind of pressed material or anything like that, right? These are natural nuggets. You can, can you imagine? I couldn't, you can't even buy no. the material. It no. would be impossible. This is like when they do these deals like this, and I always come in and I, I, I literally almost faint uh -huh. because I go, you know, people actually are going to start believing yes. that this is a reality. Yes. And, no. it, and it, so you couldn't even, if, if you lived in my world, if you live in my world as a man, manufacturer and when I saw that I just thought that's yeah, that's just totally crazy. Yeah. That's crazy. And Jay said, I said, hey, Jay, do you think we could show this? We've got the final quantities on this. He says, am I okay? What price is that? This you is can't nuts. even get the material. And remember, and those when are you all see the... nuggets like that, Jay, there's a lot of waste, well, right? Right. These, but these are the natural nuggets. Okay, so they're, they're the, those are natural pieces. Yeah. Think about that. I had to take a nugget that big to cut the, you know, and when I'm cutting it, what we're doing is we're just uh, doing what they call, um, uh, we're just shaping it. We're just right. shaping the bead. Um, so... But the, the, and those are the natural colors, but what's really cool with the Azure Peaks on this, this, uh, this is a mine in Mongolia. It's not a big mine, it's a very, very small um, deposit actually. But look at, the, those are the natural blues. Oh and then you've got those tealy, kind of like tealy blues, right and there might be yeah. like a darker blue in that. But for the most part, extremely consistent. Okay. But I'm just telling you, if, without doing anything, if I just went out and, and the rough, and got the nuggets, right? Y you would be hard pressed, hard pressed to be able to just buy the material just before you do anything with it. Correct. That you would just almost be impossible to get. And here again, I, I think that every show you always, cause you know, I, I specialize in turquoise. Turquoise is my deal, man. I, you this know, is turquoise. Like where every trip starts for tur today. Turquoise and then opal. Okay, that's that's how <laughs> that's how this that's all starts, jam. right? And it's it's been that way my entire career, my entire life. But uh, we're not gonna have a lot of turquoise. In fact, I, I believe this is just, uh, wow. this is the very first necklace that we've actually shown. And, and I really haven't uh, looked at the, the rest of the event, but I know that we don't have a lot of turquoise for right. the event. And so remember, it is Jay's 23rd anniversary. Consider this almost like a little today's special. Kind of like a happy birthday to and, you. And, <laughs> right? And look, $13.58 on the five flex pay. Jay literally laughed when I told him and showed him this. It was modestly appraised at $195. If you are the person that loves to see turquoise with its natural character, the veining, the spidering, this is your turquoise. Remember, this is all hand done, all hand strung, and this is its natural God-given color. Jay does nothing to this, but get it ready to go and stabilize it so it stays that blue you yeah, fell in and love and with, we, right? Yeah, when we say stabilize, all you're doing, just like opals, yeah. just like uh, turquoise, there's so many different materials that we deal with. They're hydrated stones. That means that there, there was water in the process that, that created them, right? That, because, um, you know, they're, they're what they call a secondary replacement. Right. So with turquoise, if you don't, if with opals, if you don't stabilize them, uh, 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 several things can happen. I'm not saying mm. they always will happen, mm. but they, uh, because of, like, when you handle them on a daily basis, right? right? The Just the lotions, the oils, uh, uh, pollution in the air, like pearls, everything like that. Right? If you do not seal them, if you don't, if you don't, the, and seal the porosity uh, that you can't see with the naked eye, you could, mm -hmm. you could, you probably couldn't even barely see it with a microscope. Yeah. If you don't seal that, 
the chances are that you can, it will become impregnated with something else, and then, then you'll have a problem. And you, that, all you're gonna do is ensure that this is, now here again, we haven't done anything. This is the natural material. Mm. This is the natural color. We have not enhanced it. We haven't done anything to change the color. This is the natural color, but it will remain that color. I you're not will. gonna, you're not gonna, um, I have a lot of what I call antique pieces that I have in my private collection that uh, back in the, uh, they, they were created in the 40s and 50s, okay, uh, before, uh, some of them were created before I was born. And now when I look at them over the years that I've had them, a lot of the really beautiful high, high blue turquoise pieces that I have, now some of them are starting to turn green. Right, and, and yellow the, a little, right? And, well, sure. the reason is, is they're oxidizing over time, but because they, they weren't stabilized. And so they, they've changed, and I don't even wear them. I mean, they're in a collection. They're in, in kind of like showcases. So um, they're, they're specimens, you know, of, of jewelry that, that, and how jewelry was made over time. And so I'm just saying that uh, one thing that's really cool with this is you're gonna get something that is going to be this color everlasting. Mm. And Jay, I mean, at half off today, we are very limited in our quantities. You won't see much turquoise in the visit, uh, but we'll let you know when it's gone. 597746 is your item number. Place your order. It is 18 inches, and you do have those free form ovals and nuggets of that beautiful uh, 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 turquoise with the little round beads in between as well. Now, we got to do some bracelets, and this is not just any bracelet. Bracelet. These are bracelets that are part of Jay's gallery collection. Uh, we've got it in two choices today, and look at what we did. We took over $100 off today on this beautiful uh, hinge bangle. Your choices are the multicolor agate, where you get the warm honeys and the lemons and the butterscotch uh, inlay pieces, or you can choose the turquoise, and then you choose your size. Small, medium would be what I would wear, six and a quarter to six and three quarter wrist. Jay would wear something from the medium large, right? So two choices in color and two choices in sizes. But Jay, you said, and I quote, and this is a customer pick. Our customer made it a customer pick. You said in your career, this is in your top three of bracelet designs. That's that, a, that we've those ever are done. big words. Right. And, and here's, the, here's the key thing. Just the bangle concept, bangle bracelet. Uh, in 43 years, uh, can you imagine that I've designed a few different kinds of cuffs and bracelets? I was going to specialize sir. in them, right? <laughs> the biggest thing, the reason I always stayed away, shied away from bangles is because uh, bangles, you have to make them large enough to go over the hand. And everyone knows that your hand is always bigger than your wrist, right? Sure. Okay, and then some people have larger hands and smaller wrists. Mm. Um, what happens is, so you have to make them big enough to go over the hand, so they go over the hand, but then they're on the wrist and they bang around, right? And right. There's, there's so much a big gap, and it was always something I stayed away from because they were just hard to, to make them comfortable. I, I hate when we, we design, I like to make things that are very very user friendly, very rare friendly. I mean, the design is everything is how cool, mm. but it has to be functional to me. Yeah. And so we came up with this hinge system. Now, here again, this is one of those crazy, outrageous deals that, that they're doing with what we have remaining. So you can get this in the, the multicolored turquoise, which all comes from a deposit in Mongolia, or you can get the amber, which is Baltic amber, oh and uh, Ukrainian amber out of the, those deposits. But I, here's what I wish I could do right now. Uh, maybe one of these days soon, I could literally reach through the TV screen and hand you this and say, here, feel Hold this. this. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Hold yeah, this, feel right. this. Right. This is not some it little- feels solid. It is a chunk of silver. Okay, yeah. this is it massive. Really it's massive. And when you, when you have it and you feel and you go, I mean, oh you my gosh, see. You see the that? weight. You would, you would think it would be some little lightweight uh, piece. It's not. This is just a deal that they're doing. It's incredible, it, incredible, easy, wear friendly, user friendly. Uh, all the materials here again, genuine amber. We haven't done anything to enhance no, the colors. No color the turquoise, no color enhancement. Um, this is truly probably one of the best buys um, that you're gonna that you're gonna see for this this whole two day. I event. would say so. And look at the appraisal value, three hundred and forty five dollars. That's the low Jay. appraisal. That's, that's the, the third lo lowest. Third lowest out of three. They take the the lowest lowest, and um, and then on top of that, I mean, even at what we were doing, you have to understand we manufacture this from ground up. So there is no middleman. We're a niche business. I, I really don't know anybody else 
that really does fully, some people are close, but very few people do what we do, where we go mine direct. We, we go direct to the, we buy the material, we do all the designing in-house, we do all the silver work, we do all the lapidary work in-house, and then the beauty of it, we mine, oh, uh, we, um, we sell directly here on the Mine Find show. <clears throat> so you're really kind of getting it mine direct. Mm. Um, so th there really are, limited to no middlemen, mm -hmm. right, in anything My we do, goodness. as is. And that's to bring you the original price. Mm. So this, I'm just telling you, this is a crazy, exceptional value. So remember, you've got the multicolor option of the amber. So amber. you've got the honeys and the lemons and, and the, the, the butterscotch, butterscotch, which is so, so Take rare. A look there. Less than 5% of all amber see that? harvested is the butterscotch color. Uh, and then you have the choice of the multicolored turquoise, okay, also beautiful. By the way, just setting these inlays on that curved surface is a work of art and labor right there of love. If you look at that, that's all oh three-dimensional. Yes, so absolutely. So it's all three-dimensional. Um, and, and then remember, choose your color and then choose your size. Small, medium is a six and a quarter wrist, a six and three quarter. Medium, large would be a seven uh, to a seven and a half inch. Customer pick, lowest price we've ever been able to do. These are some of the specials you can expect for Jay's 23 years with us. Remember, over 